Hi everybody, it's Honest John again. Now there are a lot of different ways of lying and believe me, politicians are masters of every single one of them. You can um, deliberately misstate the facts. You can say something is true that is just simply not true or vice versa. You can cite some facts but leave out others. You can try to spin facts to say something that they don't actually say. Um, uh, now, Daryl Issa, during uh, his various hearings, has shown a remarkable ability to lie in, in several different ways. Um, during the Benghazi hearings, Issa made statements about information his committee had that implied that he had uncovered misdeeds by Hillary Clinton and Barack Obama. That was a complete misstatement of the facts. And he released edited transcripts that supported his lies. The Democrats countered this by releasing the full transcripts which revealed what a liar he is. Isa also lied by omission by leaking some things and holding others back. Now, Chris Christie has now created a, a lie that is an all-time original whopper. Here's what he did. In a recent radio appearance, he said that the people of New Jersey are not interested in the Bridgegate scandal. I've had two town hall meetings, he said and nobody has asked any questions about it. And that's true. But before those town hall meetings, those in attendance were instructed not to ask questions about the Bridgegate scandal and told that the governor would not answer any questions about that subject. So to go on the radio and offer this as proof that the public is not interested is a mammoth exercise in dishonesty. I can confidently say, without referring to Christie's weight problems, that he is a big, fat liar. Thanks for listening.